G'day everyone, JT here. The other day I was working in Tinkercad, I was doing my normal stuff, and I found a particular scenario that I wasn't overly pleased with. What I'm doing right now is just making two boxes. You can see one's taller than the other, that'll help with the demonstration. What I wanted to do was align two objects. Now this is pretty standard stuff. I click and drag across them both, or click and shift click on them to select them both. I press the L key for the Align tool, which I won't be referencing any further. L. I center them left to right. I center them in their sides. You can see they're centered there, no problem. What actually uh, you can do from here is if an object is off to the side and you select both of those objects, L for Align, center them here, you can see the outline that Tinkercad is going to uh, put them, basically split the difference of the overall length. This is all well and good. I have no problems here. This is where I had my problem. This object needs to be precisely there in my model. I'm going to lock it. Because I've locked it, I want things to align to it. So when I now click off it, you can see it's got a border. Click on, shift click, L for align, center. That has not centered the orange box across the length of the red box. Okay, let's do it again. Just selecting both. L for align. Center. Center. Oh no, that's nowhere near centered. How do I know it's not centered? Because when I drag it here I can see clearly that it's not centered. Okay. What to do? Let's say I want to center the orange box on the red box. Red box is locked. Here's the trick. Select all, or select those two. L for align. Choose an edge. Once you've done the edge, the orange box is now within the overall length of the red box. Center. Similarly, now these are actually the same width, so it's not really a good demonstration. There we go. Similarly, L for Align, Hard Edge, Center. What this means is, if we have a box, and the perspective is playing with us here, if we have an object that fits within another, you can in fact uh, align it to the center or edge of a locked box, and the technique is align it to an edge first. Perspective back on, drag this away, Select the both, L for align, align it to here, then to center, align it to here, then to center. That's the workaround. Now, there is a problem. You can't do it when a box is longer than the locked object. This guy is clearly longer. Selecting them both, L for align, hard edge, center, 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 other edge, doesn't work. Here's where we actually have to do some maths and physically work out what's going on. So this is a caveat where it's not going to work, but for an object that is shorter than the locked object, it's easy. Hard edge, center, hard edge, center. All right, well, that's it for me. I hope you found this enjoyable. Uh, like, share, subscribe, all of that good sort of stuff. Make some comments. Uh, and I will talk to you guys again next time.